Right. So if you have read and understood, considering it's surgical pathology station, kindly tell me what are the differential diagnoses that you'll consider for this patient? Hello, I'm sorry. Okay. Yes. yes. What differential? Yes, I said, considering it's surgical pathology station, what are the differential diagnoses that you would consider for this patient? Yes, ma'am. Um, I'll consider a diagnosis of um, um, lung cancer. Um, I would also consider um, um, pulmonary tuberculosis. Okay. Um, I would also consider lymphoma. Yes. Um, and then... How um, yes, yes How would you confirm um, your diagnosis? Yes, ma'am. Um, I'll do um, sputum acid fast um, bacillus. Okay. Um, the and... chest x-ray has already been done. I would also um, do um, PCR analysis um, for and gene expert analysis um, for uh, um, TB, mycobacterium tuberculosis. Yes. Um, I would also um, want to do um, 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 biopsy for yes. if there's any lymph nodes, I would want to send for biopsy and histology. Yes. Um, um, a CT scan is also can also be done for the patient. Okay. Um, um, for the confirming diagnosis, um, histology will show presence of um, um, lung um, gran, 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 um, caseating granuloma with presence of um, lung hands um, giant cell. Can you um, define the term granuloma? Yes, ma'am. A granuloma is um, a, an organized collection of macrophages, um, yes. which are spe epi um, usually epithelial macrophages fusing um, to form, which some fusing to form Langhans giant cells with um, areas of um, lymphocytic infiltrates. What are the different types of granulomas that you know of? Yes, ma'am. They can be um, caseating granuloma and non caseating granuloma. Okay. Uh, can you give examples of each? Can anyone? Can be yes? caseating and caseating and non caseating granulomas. Yes, example of each. Yes, ma'am. Um, example in caseating granuloma can be seen in tuberculosis. Um, um, and other uh, mycobacterial agents, while non caseating granuloma is commonly seen in um, um, sarcoidosis, um, Crohn's. Cat, scratch disease, histoplasmosis, Crohn's disease. Crohn's. Okay. Uh, Can you diagnosis. please tell me if uh, the histology report comes, how would you def how would you base your uh, diagnosis? Depending yes, upon um, the yes histology yes, report. Yes, um, the, my, I'll make my diagnosis uh, based on the histology report. If there is presence of a granuloma, um, um, caseating granuloma, I would likely be, um, it would likely be tuberculosis, uh, mycobacterium tuberculosis. While if it is, um, if there's presence of um, Ritz-Steinberg cells, um, may be indicative of um, lymphoma, um, uh, a, a non-Hodgkin's lymphoma. Um, also, what are the zones uh, which are normally seen on histological report? Yes, ma'am. Um, the out zones, ma'am. Yes, okay. yes. Resorption zone, granulation zone, mature connective tissue zone. If you can tell me what these are with examples. Okay. okay. 
um, resorption. Okay, I, I, maybe, mom, let me come to that. Come again. Okay. Come. All right, yeah. all right. Can you please tell me, you said uh, you'll consider one of the diagnoses as mycobacterium tuberculosis. So can you please tell me what is mycobacterium? Yes, ma'am. Mycobacterium is um, an acid fast bacillus. is a weekly gram-positive um, bacillus, which... Um, which uh, is a weekly gram positive bacillus, which um, is not easily cultured in normal media. Um, it's. Um, okay, can you please various... tell me what test can you do for the rapid detection of mycobacterium? Yes, ma'am. Mantle test, ma'am. Okay, any, any other? Yes. Have you um, heard of cannot... Recom? Yes. RPA, recombinase polymerase yes, amplification, what that is? Yes, um, they are um, tests that are usually done uh, using uh, um, genetic, um, use, using genetic uh, PCR, I think, analysis to assess for um, the um, genetic components of the my uh, mycobacterium CV. Other than mycobacterium tuberculosis, uh, what are the other mycobacterium that you know of? Yes, ma'am. There is a uh, mycobacterium avium. Yes. Mycobacterium intercellular. There's mycobacterium bovis. There's mycobacterium lepre. Um, All right. Okay. Can you please tell me what is the most proteinous substance that can be found uh, systemically in tuberculosis patients? Amyloid type A. Amyloid. A amyloid. A amyloid. Okay. Can you please tell me? How would you label the specimen that you'll take, sputum specimen? Yes, ma'am. It's be labeled as a category B U N three seven three three. So U N three three seven three um specimen, and it's to be placed in a biohazard um, bag. Bag. Okay. Uh, what what precautions would you do, or what measures would you take, uh, if you get the confirmation from the histology report that patient has tuberculosis? Yes, ma'am. Um, the precaution is to place to um, um, isolate the patient and use um, ensure that um, one um, barrier nursing will be instituted. Um, patient to be um, um, the care, um, the nursing staff and the doctors will ensure to wear gloves and to ensure um, personal protective equipment, including use of N95 masks. And then there will be contact tracing that will also be done, and they will be encouraged to screen and be observed for development of mycobacterium TB. Okay, so, uh, there uh, in, uh, what is giant cells, if you can tell me? Okay, um, giant cells are multinucleated um, cells that comprise of um, um, multinucleated cells usually, um, which are usually macrophages that are fused, yes, to form. Yes. Uh, what are the different types, can you please tell? Yes, ma'am, there are... Uh, Yes, there's Langerhans um, giant cell. There is um, um, Rich Steinberg cells. And then there's another one, I think. Heart Histeo. 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 Yes, Histeo. Yes, Histeo. Yes. Histeo. yes. All right. How would you differentiate uh, on the basis of, how would the management differ on the basis of your differential diagnosis? Yes, ma'am. Um, the, for um, patients with uh, the, it, the, for patients with um, tuberculosis, mycobacterium tuberculosis, one well, will commence the patients on directly observed treatment short course for TB um, um, using um, rifampicin isoniazid. And, um, um, and then while well, for patients with um, 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 Hodgkin's yeah. lymphoma, one well, will commence, um, well, we'll commence the patients on, on chemotherapy. And while well, for lung cancer, um, one well, will have to stage the disease um, institute multidisciplinary for both his, um, Hodg um, lympho for both Hod non -Hodgkin's, Hodgkin's lymphoma and lung cancer. One would have to institute multidisciplinary uh, team management involving the oncologist, the uh, um, um, the surgeon, and can you please uh, describe the image that you're looking at? Yes, ma'am. Um, this is um, H and E uh, hematoxylinosin um, um, stain. Yes. Um, Yes, ma'am. Containing with um, areas of showered um, basophilic staining, um, multiple um, cells with um, areas presence of giant cells and areas of caseating, um, sorry, um, caseous necrosis. 
possibly um, this is likely um, um, which um, the giant, this uh, this nuclear nuclei of the giant stars are arranged in an eccentric ma manner, horseshoe shaped appearance. This is likely um, a sphume or from a sample from um, Mycobacterium tuberculosis. Okay, which stain uh, do they use in particular for Mycobacterium tuberculosis? Yes, they are now since then. Okay, how would you differentiate between the microbiology uh, and the cytology? Yes, ma'am. The okay, ma'am. The um the cytology usually contains just um some cells um that um that stain positively for the the acid fast while the microbiology. Um, usually contains um, um, mucous material with um, smear. I'm not sure. Okay, can you please explain the image that you're looking at? Okay, ma'am, this is um, the, a chest x ray, um, yes. posterior anterior view, which um, shows presence of multiple uh, um, pulmonary. Okay, um, it's it's um, well penetrated um, and um, it shows uh, multiple interpulmonary infiltrates with um, um, multiple um, nodular, reticular nodular opacities within in both um, lung zones, worse on the upper um, left upper zone and up both all the lung areas of the right side. There's also hilar fullness on um, both sides, worse on the uh, right left side. Um, um, and it is suggestive of, well, it's safe. Yes, ma'am. Okay, good, thank you. 